They're good. They're good. Relentless pressure. We, we, we felt like we'd have a chance to come in here and play a good game. I like my team. We'd already, you know, beaten some nice teams on the road. We just hadn't seen anything. I'm sure you hear that from a lot of coaches, but we just hadn't seen anything quite like that. Um, it's great environment, great, great fans. Um, and then obviously relentless pressure. We didn't handle it well. And uh, I thought we had our guys in the right place, but obviously 18 steals for them, 22 turnovers for us. And second half kind of got away from us. First half was about the way we wanted to play. I thought we could have been even closer than we were in the first half. We missed some shots normally that we make. But we felt decent at halftime. Second half got away from us, which, which can happen when you play them. But they're good. They're good. They've got a nice team. I think you called a quick timeout after Johnson hit that second three-pointer in the second half. Is it, was that to remind them of what, what he did at Cincinnati? or? I mean, no, not, not really. I mean, it's just to, you know, we'd cut it to six. We were, it was nine. We'd cut it to six, and then bam, bam, two threes later, it was up to 12. We just thought we needed a timeout there. Um, you need a lot of timeouts when you play VCU here at home. We didn't have enough. We used them all, and I, 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 it'd been nice to have two or three more. But um, they're, again, they're not an easy team to play. Got a lot of players. They run a lot of guys at you. And then they just put a lot of pressure on you, inline out of bounds, sideline out of bounds, press. Um, again, we knew the most critical stat in the game was going to be turnovers in 22. It just doesn't give you a chance to win. It's just too many. So. We, if we would have turned it over less, obviously they scored, I don't know how many in the second half, they scored a lot of points, second half transition points off turnovers. Um, the turnovers really killed us. They have a lot of games where it seems like there's almost an avalanche where they just kind of get something going and yeah. before you know it, it's a 15 to two run. Yeah. How, do you, how do you stop that? Good players. I mean, not turn it over. I mean, the, the bottom line, you can't turn it over a lot against them. Uh, if you turn it over a lot against them, the game's going to, it's going to avalanche on you. And you, I, you got to make some shots. I thought we got some, you know, like with Sean Rembert made nine threes in our last game against Eastern Kentucky. He was two for nine tonight. Now, I think a lot of that is VCU's defense, so I'm not saying it's just on Rashawn. And obviously, he made one of those threes at the buzzer. So he was one for nine going into that. But they did a really nice job on him. But um, they've just got an, a relentless style for 40 minutes, and it, it can wear on you. You know, and our guards just didn't handle the pressure like they needed to handle it. And when you, when you don't handle their pressure, again, it leads to steals. And then the steals lead to transition baskets. And the transition baskets then lead to their press. So it's all, it all triggers. You know, if you, if you don't turn it over and you can get a shot, you get, you've got a chance. But when they, when they have 18 steals, force 22 turnovers, again, the turnovers lead to transition. And the transition leads to their press. And then it just, here we go again. So, again, I thought the first half, we played it about the way we wanted to play it. Second half just got away from us, got away from us, which I'm sure they don't lose in here much. Happens a lot. So, a um, couple more, anything else? Okay, all right, yep, yep, okay. Thanks, Coach.